Hey, do you got a minute? Yeah, I do. Do you? I do. Do you? Yeah, do you? You know what? What? I don't think this is going to fit in a minute. I I think you're right. There's so much to see in this one in this one virtual. It's just I don't know. Let's try. Let's see what we can do. Yeah. Okay. One cash. One minute. Cue the title and start the clock. Let's go. Beside the blue sign is a picture with people in front of a house. Including this picture, count 13 pictures to your left. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What's a five digit number in the photo and what is the number on? And then what do we do? Then we count another five photos to the left and up two. One, two, four, five. Part of the qualifications for this cache is to pick your favorite photo, and this one reminded me of my dad and his love of boats. I like this photo because the ladies are dressed in their fancy ball gowns, and they look beautiful. That was amazing virtual with all those photographs put together. Yeah, it was really yeah, awesome. Great mosaic. And what's even more awesome is we have the CO with us right here. DGAS 71, this is an awesome virtual. What made you decide to do this one? Well, I was awarded a, a virtual cache and I had trouble deciding where to place it. I knew somewhere in Muskoka. I thought Bracebridge, my hometown, Gravenhurst, which I've lived in, lived in for several years. And then I thought, no, Port Carling. It's got the perfect location for a cache that will be very interesting for a lot of geocachers. It was interesting looking at all the photographs through the years and the different styles of clothing and how people lived. Mm -hmm. It's really interesting. If, uh, if you didn't do that one, was there anything else that you were thinking of doing for the virtual or was that absolutely it? A couple of other ideas I had were the, the steamships in Gravenhurst at the Muskoka Wharf mm -hmm. or the, the Bracebridge waterfalls here in Bracebridge. Uh, there's several waterfalls around Bracebridge. Uh, if you've never been to Bracebridge, come here, explore the area. It's beautiful. Like all of Muskoka, just explore. Waterfalls? We missed waterfalls? <laughs> oh, we have to come back! We'll come back when the blueberries are out. Okay. When's that? June? That's now! <laughs> <laughs> they weren't quite ready yet. We saw some plants, but there are no blueberries no, yet. Not yet. Dave might look familiar. It's DGAS71, but he has a YouTube channel. If you haven't seen my YouTube channel, it's David's Geocaching Adventure Series. Uh, so the link is up here. <laughs> so please subscribe. David, thank you very yeah. much for joining us on Cache Canada. Yeah, it was awesome to see you. We could not come up this far and not drop in to see you. So thank you for stopping by and thank you for finding my virtual. And don't forget the bonus question on the virtual. Not many people have got the bonus question, but I'm guessing you will. We'll have to look that one up because I don't know the answer to it. Yeah, I know. The pressure's on now. <laughs> Keep watching. There's more caches to be found. Yeah, where, where will, will geocaching, geocaching take, take you? you?